afternoon, morning, evening, or night. What we're doing today is located in the middle of the very next screen. And in the middle of the very next screen is a game that all of you guys should be familiar with. The franchise in question is a very, very popular franchise in the indie horror sphere, especially because of the fact that it tends to use your microphone as a gameplay mechanic a lot of the time. And located in the middle of the screen is a game that goes by the name of, get a quiet drum roll going, and then slowly increase the volume. And then increase it really quickly so you can- Fears to fathom! Wait, wait, wait. Woodbury Gateway! I think I've played every episode of Fist to Fathom, except the very first one. I think that's the only one that I haven't played yet, but I've played every episode of Fist to Fathom. And from what I recall, I think this is the last one in this season. So I don't know what to expect. It could be something extremely good, or it could be a Game of Thrones season eight. I have no idea what to expect. But people are saying this is pretty damn good. So I guess without further uh Okay, this need <laughs> I legit I don't know what every single time I do that, I think this needs is arriving and it never does. <gasps> Let's play Fist of Fathom Woodbury get get away. Wait. We'll have to do tech support. <laughs> Why is there a <laughs> Why is there a toggle for toilets out? Wait, 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 wait. Fist to Fathom is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short story narrated by the ones who survived. You're playing episode five, episode playtime, two hours. Oh, that's a lot longer than pick a saved game, new game. All right, let's go. The saga is complete. I can kill myself now. Fist to Fathom. Episode 5, Woodbury Gateway. Uh, getaway. I keep saying Gateway. December the 8th. Are we driving? Oh, look at that setup. Needed coffee to get done with the day. All right. Let's go get some coffee. Oh, my God. Oh, oh good Lord. Nah. Nah. You're not going to have all the lights on and waste the electricity bill? No. <laughs> Wait, let me let me see if I can play some video games on this PC. Are there any are there any games? At that point, I couldn't continue my work without a cup of coffee. 324 grand? It's a lot of money we're playing with. Yeah, I'm gonna see this. I'm gonna see this uh this alien game. Alright, let's see this. Type invader reloaded. Is it wait, is this is this like maybe speak? Wait, what? 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 Uh, cow. Oh my god. Oh my god, it actually is one of those games you play on Mavis Beacon. All right, uh, team ring game deal. 100% accuracy. All right, I'm, I'm gonna do it. This is sick. This is sick. A game within a game. Do you reckon there's like an achievement for this? Afraid came I poem back set. Oh yeah. Quite a lot of aliens. What's the end game gonna be though? Uh, has used. Oh my god, it's time to run. Ah! My accuracy is going down. But right, east many subjects occur. Don't challenge me. I got 120 WPM. All right, but early. Oh, early dog point. I believe. All right, dress always. There we go. Wave toward hot copy score new set. Oh, is that it? Is that it? This game actually kind of rocks. Get me in the car. We just got an achievement. Beat minigame with 70 plus HP. Let's go. <laughs> Unable to execute. Devs are too lazy to program it. <laughs> Let's go and leave this leave this PC then. No, I'm not going to. I'm not going to search for boobs in an office PC. If you search that in, then you paint a target on yourself. Like your PC will make like a really, really loud noise and everyone will know that you search for some boobs. Needed to prepare a cup of coffee. I don't want it. Oh, we can throw it. That's not Pete. That's not pizza, is it? I can't be pissing in a microwave. <laughs> Honestly, I've never, um, I've never heard of anyone that goes out of their way to uh, Microsoft, Microsoft, microwave, <laughs> microwave pizza, Microsoft to pizza. That's mental. What's wrong with tap water? Now nah, you need some, you need some gamer subs by using code tap or T9. Needed to put on a lit. Do we have to do everything like that? Can't you just do that automatically? Let's get that eating ASMR. All right, or that drinking ASMR. Yeah, 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 another sip. Oh my God, how much, how much, are we just gonna keep sipping? Okay, fine. I needed to use the restaurant. Why, why is it in every single Fist to Fathom game, the main character needs to piss? I bet there's gonna be an achievement for miss. You know what? I'm gonna, 
I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna second. Let me go to the bathroom. It's like the corpse party syndrome. What's with all of them having uh, and then like a need to, I need to go and piss. Oh my God. There's even a wait. <laughs> Imagine just waiting out here. It's like, you done yet? Are you done? I was done with it. Um, can I just, oh, we probably should um, put this. You know what? I'm, I'm just going to keep this over here for the time being. Um, but first look at the mirror. We're a vampire. Go in the ladies one. I already, I already went in the ladies one. Oh, yeah. oh my God. Oh my gods. What have they Oh my, oh my God. Wait, are all of them like that? Are all of them like this? Oh. We can, we can drink it. Should we drink it? Should we drink it? <laughs> Do we drink it? I'm gonna drink it. There's not even any dialogue for that. I just drank it. Just drank it. I can imagine the sniper just going, piss. I had to put the toilet seat down. All right, hold on. Privacy. Why is that toilet? <laughs> That's what I toilet sounds that's not even my toilet sounds doesn't mean why is there a meter for that hold i swear to god i heard someone i'm really i'm gonna open this and there's gonna be someone we're tall enough to look over come on all right is the Torazan? Torazan! I knew it! 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 Hi. Whoa, ma'am. Sorry. Didn't know anyone was. Ah. Whoa, ma'am. Sorry. Didn't know anyone was in here. I knew that was gonna happen. Like I knew it. But I don't like that. I don't like the look on your face. Yeah, that's kind of cool though. You almost gave me a heart attack. I'm so sorry. Should have knocked before I came in, but there isn't usually anyone in here this late. No, it's fine. You're just doing your job. Again, I'm sorry. I usually do knock, but I'm a little bit frustrated tonight. Must have slipped my mind. What has you frustrated? Someone keeps throwing coffee cups on the floor all over the office. It's been happening for weeks. Was that me? That's really, really rude. I, I wonder who did that. The person who did that's a massive cock. Well, I need to get back to it. Don't want to be here all night picking up coffee cups. Have, yeah, yeah. Yeah, have a, have, have a good night. I don't do that again. You never, that, never do that again. You're not even doing a good job. Why are you, there's nothing to clean there. There's nothing. You need to be cleaning there. Wait, you're not gonna let. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. I did nothing. I did nothing. Yeah, we didn't. We, we, we didn't. We did. We did Nathan. We did Nathan. Oh. Hello. Hey, Harp. It's Mike. Ah, I was about to say. Hey, Mike. Hack, you didn't wash your hands. Yeah, I did. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? Yeah, my phone's been acting up lately. Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> ha! 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 No, it even cut out on a client earlier. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, ha! Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's kind of late ah yes we're working as a game dev circa 2023 more overtime damn Art, that sounds rough good thing i called to cheer you up now come now come on mike michael mickey why, why would you say that um about our trip did you get a chance to book the rental house just really wanted to see you and nora mm. No worries, Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Hey, okay, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah, hey. yeah, yeah. Yes. 
I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. Why do you re- <laughs> You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. We can't say no. Yeah, I'll hit them with the sounds good. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Yeah, 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 yeah. let me go oh, to work. Uh, wait, one more thing. Yeah? When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under a hundred dollars a night. Under one hundred a night, okay. Nora and I were talking, and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. We can choose to hang out. <laughs> I think you choose to hang up. <laughs> make sure. I'll, I'll definitely find something affordable. Right, shot. It'll be just like the old college days. You always had a knack for finding the best spots. I should. Can you? Can you not like? Um, no. Can you, can you stop speaking? I need to book it. Right, right, of course. Sorry for yapping. I'm just excited, I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, talk to you later, Harp. See ya. Are we booking here? Why we just typed in boo? Oh, it forces us to type this. Boo. I mean, that's a weird way to spell boobs. All right, where are we going? T T. I bet you can't beat the typing alien game with 100% accuracy and 100% health like me. I got 99% accuracy and 70 health. You want me to do it again? Oh! 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 Gonna have to hold let him know this is this is oh god oh no oh no oh no okay if I do it all right let's go book it. Damn, 3.1 out of five, with two reviews, 99. I mean it is under 100. <laughs> All right, cool. Hey, I'm assuming you get hundreds if not thousands of stories sent daily. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. I'm sorry if some of it's written weird, but I was rushed. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. Ah, yes, the the game dev the game dev life i'm sydney harper and this story takes place during one of those days where you don't want to wake up everything is fucked everybody sucks one of my college friends mike suggested that we take a weekend getaway to rural vermont it sounded like a perfect break from the cycle awake and my other friend nora was quick to jump on board as well the plan was simple we rent a small cabin close our shift early on friday leave and be back on monday mike came to pick me up two days later two days later we're gonna go to this Yo, what's up? Is that a PlayStation P? I don't like that angle. I don't like I don't like that angle. I don't wanna hang up. I forgot my oh, oh! oh my god, I'll close. Pulling into the parking garage now. You down? Yeah, where you at? Oh, there you are. Hi, Sydney. Thanks for booking my property in Woodbury for December 10th to 12th. I'm Rick. Yo, ooh. We're post. We're trusting a person hosting a cabin called Rick. Really? We know our code. Um, let's see. Just booked. Do you ever answer the phone anymore? Call me, please. Harp. Hug. Fine. I'll hug. Your shoulders smell nice. That's still how you hug people. Yeah. I was just. I was just sniffing your shoulder. Why didn't you hug me like you missed me? Just a test hug to see if you smell. <laughs> Fair enough. But for the record, I showered just for the occasion. Nothing is too good for Sydney Hop. You you showered just for the. Are you implying that you implying that you're not showering before? Oh no! I'm just gonna give uh, give a bit of a chuckle, like the sensible. <laughs> Listen, if it were me, I'd have crushed the spine by now. There we go. You look good. Um. Thanks for picking me up. Wouldn't have it any other way. It'll be nice to have some company on the way. Ah, this old truck bring back so many memories, right? This bad boy's been through a lot. You can just throw your stuff in the back and we'll get on our way. All right then, Harp, are you ready to hit the road? Wait, hold on. That's a good question. Where's Nora? She'll meet us there. The route through the city would have been a detour for her anyway. All right then, Harp, let's... Blood teleported, holy shit. All right. Everywhere we go, 
everywhere we go. People want to know. Oh, damn, 4.26 p.m. Who we are, who we are, and where we come from. It was starting to snow. Now he's, now he's attentive to the road. Oh my God. Hey, hey, pay attention. Harp, isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college and now here we are trying to escape. Hey, hey, look at the rock. We couldn't wait to get out into the real world. Maybe we just didn't know how much the real world would, you know. Hey, the guys on the rock. Suck sometimes. Hey, stop. Look at the rock. We're going to crash. We're going to die. Change is just hard. Like trying to adjust to the look at the rock. Speaking of jobs, how's it going so far? We're working on this project that uses machine learning to predict market trends. It's pretty cutting edge stuff. Sounds like you're shaping the future. Not quite Tony Stark yet, but I'll take it. Wait. Yeah, okay. I, I was gonna I was gonna say what what is is Iron Man ubiquitous at this time? Are we talking 08 or what? Anyway, we got we got a message. You know, I never understood. What do consultants even do? Uh <laughs> we consult. That sounds like Wait, what? 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 There was a school bus. Uh, what? Did you see that school bus? See what? There was a school bus back there by the old house. Maybe it's a project. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home on wheels or something. I've read people do that on the internet. It's nearly 5 p.m. and I haven't received a confirmation text from you. I just wanted to check in to make sure everything's okay. The roads near Woodbury can be a little dangerous if you're not from the area. Uh, please let me know when you arrive. Thanks, Rick. We're on our way around the Jamea 6 p.m. I was reading! Oh, snap! My, that was close! You know... I read on the internet that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the universe. Is it now? Anyway. Okay, please confirm when you check in and travel safe. Yeah, I will. I will! Don't worry! You got any, you got any funny tunes on the radio? Are we there yet? Are we even close? Should be about an hour and a half from here. Okay. You know, driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the intergalactic spit. We need to get this guy some weed stat. <laughs> Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. <laughs> That's the kind of something you're like, oh, dude, dude, it's like, like snow is like the energy of the, the universe just rolling past us like holy shit bro it's kind of beautiful yeah <coughs> all right are we there yet 5 14 p.m oh shit damn 5 14 i mean oh my god oh my god we're not even wearing any seatbelts we're gonna crash and die your heart check that out oh into if you have that interrupted, then most pizza. Hey, wait, are we going for pizza? You know, Harp, I got to tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. This pizzeria is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. It's like living in the future. I'm so hungry. I think I can eat an old pizza myself. What? You're that hungry? That's that's child's play, bro. All right, then, Harp. Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. All right, let's go. Let's go and get some. What the fuck is on the telly? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's on the telly? Hey, get it. Hey, 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 get in, in, in. Okay, right, there we go. Come on in, Hop. Oh, thank you. Reports of a strong snowstorm coming towards Woodbury tonight. Uh oh. Residents are recommended Wait, to stay indoors is that and keep warm during this time. Let's check in with our field. Report. Is that queso? How's the weather out there, Phil? Oh, it's so cold out here. I, I can't feel my hands. Wait. Right. Like, uh, the studio should have really brought some snow gear and stuff. What's going on? <laughs> I'm sure you'll be fine. You can have some coffee when you get back to the studio. Jerry, you cannot be serious. You know my doctor said not to drink any caffeine. Sounds like someone's having a bad day. Maybe you <laughs> should <laughs> cool off. Good one, Holy Case! Shit. Why can't you Good one, go case. out here and deal with the snow instead of me? I've been working here for six years, and I never get to report somewhere nice. Listen, Phil, I'm just clearly the better looking one. You can worry about where you'll report once you get that rhinoplasty. <laughs> rhinoplasty? Why would I need rhinoplasty? My face looks perfectly fine. You could also use some Botox while you're at it. Actually, <laughs> maybe you should just work as a studio light engineer behind the camera. I think it would be better field of work for you. You only got your job because your sister works at the mixing board. You would have never been able to work here. <laughs> why, why is it turning into like powering each other? Why is it, wait, wait. How dare you? I'm a certified news anchor. Certified? Yeah, my ass, okay? You didn't do shit. 
how about I come by the studio and we settle this like men? Oh, yeah? <laughs> right. Let's do it, punk. We'll be right back after this commercial break. <laughs> Are you exhausted and desperately need a break? Yeah. Is your 9 to 5 stressing you out? Yeah. Take a vacation with rentacabin.com. We use them already. We offer thousands of cabins readily available and accessible with the click of a button. Enjoy amazing views and undisturbed relaxation. This is in such our a Pim and Charlie. <laughs> Now, not only are these cabins cheap, but they're also safe, with each cabin having a designated caretaker to ensure <laughs> that your stay is top-notch. We have many what options to Jimmy choose from, like including pet-friendly, alcohol-friendly, hey, family-sized, hey, underground, hey, and many more. Underground. So if you need a vacation and want it cheap, visit rentacabin.com and enjoy the stay of a lifetime. Let me advance the story while I'm at it. Uh, what, what we got? Whoa, 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 hey, 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 hey! Evening, folks. Looks like the cold's got everyone craving pizza tonight. You fine, folks, know what you want to eat? We'll get three slices each. I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and the veggie. And for you, uh, cheese, most special, and pepperoni. Any drinks? That should cover us. Just a pizza today. Thanks. All right, then. Six hot slices coming right up. That'll be 22. 22! Your order number's 27. Just grab a seat and we'll call you up when your pizza's ready. Long sniff. All right, hang on, hang on. <laughs> it smells so good in here. Oh, wait, we have to do a long sniff as well. Hang on. Yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty damn good. On. Oh. Ugh. Wait, hang on. There's a, there's a voice message. You guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as Wait. soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all of the details. Wait. The long and short of I was going to say, this is, I recognize that voice. Paint. Their payments are about the That's only Lily. thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I've got to keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it and be on my way. Yeah, Lily, you're slacking. You, you, you better be here. You better be here soon, Lily. Why is this guy? This guy has been. This guy has been walking around the store acting weird for a while. I don't like it. Hmm. Did you listen to Nora's voice message in the group? Yeah, I just saw. Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer. I guess we'll have to start the fun without her. W what can we do? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Order number 27, you folks are right here. Oh my god, there's so much eating ASMR. There's so much to... Hey! All right, let me go get my pizza. Yum, yum. Oh, yeah. Oh, damn, this pizza slaps. I don't like that ASMR in that one. This one's not good eating ASMR. I don't like it. Can't believe Nora's missing out on this bomb-ass pizza. I know, right? For some reason, we're not actually eating it. We're like... T it's telepathic eating. All right. <laughs> Yummers. Hey there, my friends. Hello there. I saw you're putting driving that nice old truck. Yeah, I yeah, I wanna know. Are you just watching who pulls in and taking notes? Not at all, my friend. I just noticed you seem to be heading in the same direction I was. Huh? You all mind if I hitch a ride with you? Dude, where's your car? Who needs a car when there are fine friends like you to pass the time with? Now, see, I, yesterday I watched them um, speak no evil, like the American remake. And from that movie, I instantly got the impression you probably shouldn't let strangers in your car. So I don't know. Y'all wouldn't even know I was there. Quiet as a church mouse and twice as nice. It's giving speak no evil. So what do you say? Care to give this free spirit a ride down that snowy road? I'm going to say no. I, I, I'm not sure. I'm sorry. Yeah. We ask Mike. Yeah, ask, ask Mike. And why are you asking me? T tell Mike. I'm not sure, man. Surely you can find just a little bit of room for me. I can ride in the middle. Hell, I'll ride in the bed. Whoa, 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 okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. It is my friend's car. I'm sorry, man. You gotta be shitting me, lady. No space. I know there's a middle seat. You scared of me or something? Yeah, okay. No, sorry. Yeah, well, why, why are you being weird? You ain't too kind, are you? Unkind people meet unkindness themselves. You best be careful out there. Time, time out there. Time out there. You can't be saying that. You can't be saying that. You could have just been like, oh, okay, then. I guess I'll ask someone, someone else. That's a red flag. 
That's a blood-covered flag. Are you threatening us? No, no, no. Y'all got me all wrong. Sorry, I'm just cold and tired is all. So now you speak up, Mike. Well, where, where were you in the last three lines of dialogue? All right, yeah, 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 yeah. You better, yeah, you better, Ron. Wait, right mouse button to burp? Ray. None of you guys are going to hear it. I'm not even going to hear it. My editor's going to hear it, though. Editor, how does the burp sound? Uh... <laughs> Imagine, imagine if I unmuted and the burp was still going. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't hit me with the XD and the hearts and the XD again. All right, let's go. All right, then. Are you ready to hit the road? Maybe we can beat the rest of the Western snow. Give me the keys. Harp, the weather's awful. Why don't you drive part of the way home? I'm going to drive so you can get a break. Take a break while I drive. Michael, why is this guy trying to shove? <laughs> I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give me, Harp. You'll be afraid if you don't give me the keys. What is the guy behind him doing? Fine, but there's one condition. What is it? I get first choice of bedrooms when or if we get there. Whatever. We got the truck keys. Oi. What do you mean if? Not, not like I'm going to kill you or anything. Oh, I, I just realized we're going to actually be driving. I think it's going to be wise to driving, isn't it? 5.49 p.m. in the big brother house. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Oh, are we on the right side of the road? Oh! As we embrace them. We're on the wrong side of the road. I'm going on the correct side of the road. All right, give me a good song. I'm driving on the right side of the road. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't think there's any problem here whatsoever. Oh! Ever? Those are the that was the Rosses. Good taste of music. I'm taking good racing lines here. I know what I'm doing. Whoops. Pop, are you okay? Do you want me to take over? No. I was out of practice with driving. Wait, what are we hitting? Vod ruined. Well, they said all they said all tracks here copyright free. Whoa! See, even the police aren't driving properly. Why should I take it seriously? I'm just trying to take good racing lines here. Come on. Where are we at? All right. Oi. 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 Don't make, don't make me. What if we just get T-boned? You suck at driving, Hag. Of course I do. I don't need to drive. I don't need it. See, there it is. Woodbury. So it was, wasn't too hard, was it? Why are there so many Rosses about? That's a good question. It says... I, what do you mean you drove past the cabin? I got it! 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 That's one way to take the scenic route, and this should be it. I thought you were just gonna keep driving there. It was a very cold night. It was a quaint little house in a quiet neighborhood. Give me one second. I th my my IRL phone went off. Five, one, seven, six. I got it! Yay! We got the keys. I've got the keys, let's enter. What a great place. I knew we could count on you. It smells so nice in here, right? But I really need to hit the john. Take your time, Mike. While I'm gone, can you put these groceries away? Should be enough space in the fridge. Got it. Where's Nora? Nora's not here. Nora's gonna be late. All right. Can we do any of the puzzles? I mean, this place is not that bad. For 99, for 99, I don't think it's that bad. I don't like the music though. The music's kind of... The, music, the music's giving me the creeps. The music doesn't sound any inviting. How about was living for, yeah, for 99 doubloons? Oh, we have to do this one at a time. Uh-oh. One at a time? Oh, that's that's just not inviting. Imagine if it's like um the visit where uh this, this actually wasn't the cabin you're supposed to be in. All right, cool. Close it. Close it. I'm going to throw it. Ah! Woo! Sorry about that, Harp. Are you okay? Long driving all that pizza really did a number on me. Hang on, I really need to pee as well. <laughs> ha, ah, toilet sounds. Well, all the groceries are put, put away. Thanks for handing that harp. Anyway, this place looks crazy nice. It's got that rustic charm you just don't see anymore. What, they really want us to go and pee? Oh my God. It's nice to get away from the city for a bit. For sure. Hey, I really need to pee. Wow, they really want us to go take a piss. You can go ahead. I'll start unpacking our bags. The smell alone told me pizza really did a number on. I don't want to open that. We have to text Rick while we're doing this. Hi, we've checked in. I'm, I'm, I'm just not letting you get any of that ASMR. My editor's going to get all of it though. Editor, you enjoying the sounds? All right, well, I'll wash your hands. Yeah, of course I'm washing my hands. Bro, Mike, you see, Mike did a number on that thing. No, there's no shot. You're feeling better after the drive? I'm good. Want to check out the house? Sounds good to me. Let's see what this place has to offer. After you. Okay. Um, oh, shit. Well, I don't like being followed. I don't, I don't, I don't like being followed. Can't wait to cook here later. Wait, when did you start cooking? I'm full of surprises. 
Oh no! I can go outside. Oh! Whoa. Oh! 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 This is too open. In the snow? Nah, bro. Nah, bro. It's getting really cold. You can get soft locked here, by the way. Fuck you, me. You can get soft locked here. Oh, this guy really must like fishing. It can be fun. Left mouse button to get close. Why do we need to get close? And are you gonna... I don't like you being in the dark like that. All right. Frozen prawns, uh, crankbait, sweet corn, wooden fishing rod, cheese delight, maggot bait. Interesting. All right, can I get out? All right, cool. <sighs> My, that was close. Now you guys are worrying me. If we can get soft locked. Uh-oh. This could be a problem. A really big problem. All right, have we been here yet? No, not now. I don't I don't think it will be a great time to do that now. This living room is bigger than my apartment. All right, that's cool. Should we go upstairs? Ah, oh, we're gonna have to do it. We're gonna have to do it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Oh, it's gonna be barbarian all over again. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm just gonna moonwalk in there so I know that you're following me. Oh, fuck. Oh, good Lord. A totally normal basement. This place totally reminds me of your college dorm. Are you sure? I don't smell the Long Beach Kush here. I told you, on God, we need to get this guy some marriage, Juana. Okay. My God. I think it's just the awkwardness that just feels really, really real. I wonder what this guy doesn't want us to see. Huh. Let's go. Wait, I'm just gonna. Yeah, I had to make sure. Bro, there's gonna be corpses in there. It's gonna be a corpse party. It's gonna be a full on corpse celebration. Dead celebration. A corpse party, if you will. Let's go upstairs. This is such a big ass garden for 19. There's a dead body. There's dead, dead, dead bodies. There are dead bodies everywhere. The TV's been on. No, 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 no 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 I call dibs on this one yeah all yours this is given speak no evil just in the snow we're just gonna find someone with like a lacerated tongue they're gonna be like yeah Nora Nora's got like a degenerative disease the fuck are you doing in here? And what's with that same jump scare sound? Oh hey, you're here. Why do you why do you look like a G a G mod? <laughs> a G mod mail, mail underscore oh four. You scared us. Oopsie daisy. I didn't mean to. Welcome to my home sweet home. What a lovely young couple. Which which um yeah we're just. We're just friends, right, Mike? Oopsie daisy, silly me. Oh, we didn't expect anyone to be here. Oh, um, I was out looking for my cat earlier, and I remember the TV has been on the fritz here. Just thought I'd stop by and try and get it working again. Those last few folks left a bad word for it. You know, is they treat your guests like family. My family doesn't go without <laughs> family without to treat your guests like family. Okay. That's a bit weird. God, he's just, just, just all staring. Speaking of that, now that your folks are here, let me show you around my home sweet home. Wait. We just... Oh my God, we were just doing that, man. I'd be a bad owner if I didn't give you the grand tour. Oh shit, I forgot the grand tour finale was on today. Host was a middle-aged man with nerves at mi middle-aged. Mi middle oh my god you've let yourself go then here's your shower that thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the amazon jungle so we're probably gonna stink afterwards oh the sink doesn't work unfortunately not to worry we'll get it fixed for you real soon let me show you the other bedroom now all right sure we were just here look harp this room has a nice ass view you think that's nice mister wait till i show you the deck wait till i show you the dick follow me now please all right cool oh my god i feel like we're getting a we're gonna play hide and seek or some shit in here. Holy smokes, this is incredible. Definitely. 
Glad you folks like it. It's one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing too. All right, folks. Let's head back in before I catch the cold here again. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I feel like we're getting a house tour because we're going to have to use this entire house later on in the game. Correct me if I am wrong, chat. Oh, shit, we, have, we weren't here a second ago. Here's the storage room. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. If the power ever goes out, you can use the flashlight here on my right. Storms like these, you never know. Dear man, what? How many times have I literally just done this because something sus has been said? Thanks. All right, folks. Let's head downstairs now. We've already had a tour of the house. It's kind of a, it's a bit crazy that we're gonna do all of that. No wonder this episode's approximately two hours. This man's so slow. Well, yeah, you gotta prevent people from refunding the game. Alrighty, folks. I see you already stocked up the fridge some tasty food. You see the knob? Turn the knob up for more cooling and down to cool it off. Tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, better show you folks the water heater. All right, let's go to the water heater. Oh my God, this is a lot. This is a long tour. Um, nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater and some old storage stuff. It never stops working. Just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right up and you'll be back in business. All right, cool. Is that, is that the tour done? Is that it? We're done? I bet, I bet he's going to ask about that room. Hey, sir, what's the deal with that room over there? Nothing you two need to concern yourselves with. I kind of use this basement as storage. Renters don't need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. Okay, well, I was just curious. Yeah, let's move on. It's the moider room. Oh, wow. Did I mention? Well, no, maybe I ought to keep it to myself. The fella I bought this house from, well, told me this mo his mother died down here. That's some um, information that would have been nice to know about two days ago. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night, said they could hear something shuffling around down here. Not to scare you folks, but if I were one of you, I wouldn't really step down here. <laughs> Looks on your faces. <laughs> on Friday the 13th, no less. <laughs> the jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> Come on now, I'm just joking. He's not joking, is he? He doesn't have the just kidding star. He ain't kidding. At this point, my creep meter was quietly pinging at around a six out of 10. Alrighty, folks, snow's starting to pick up. I'm gonna hit the road now. Gotta find that damn pussy. Thanks for showing us around. All right, go, yeah, shoo. By the way, what was the name on the booking? I must be guessing. I sw it's giving the visit. I feel like it's giving the visit. I don't think he's Rick. We haven't asked for his name. Have we asked for his name? That's not Rick. I have my suspicions. It's, why are we, it's Sydney. Ha, huh. Sydney, that's right. A pretty name for a pretty girl. Blood, is it just me or is that dude super weird? Like, yeah, weird. Anyway, let's go see if there's anything good on TV. Actually, I'm gonna go take a shower. Cool, I'll find something to watch while you're in there. Let me know if it feels like you're under a waterfall. What a weird guy. I'll see you in a bit. I'm gonna go clean my- Oh, I'm gonna shut this. I'm gonna go shower. This looks like artifacts from light baking. Why is everyone so creepy in this game? Well, if everyone was really, really nice and accommodating and didn't have anything shady about them, then it wouldn't be a fist to fathom game, would it? Can we just go fully clothed? Or do we have to like... I need to tell... Yeah, sure, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it fully clothed then. Under the waterfall. Gotta make sure all the doors are shut behind us. Any horror game, it has to be SCP etiquette. We have to make sure every door is shut. Like, you'll never know if... Whoa, what the hell are you doing? Hey, Harp, check this out. I found this fishing rod in that shed. I need to catch dinner. Now that you've mentioned, that would be a pretty epic addition to the trip. I don't know. It's cold out there. Come on, Harp. What would make this trip more epic than catching our own freaking dinner? Oh, I guess it could be fun. Hell yeah! Follow me, there's another rod in the shed, so we can both give it a shot. Okay, I'll go get another big, long rod. We're really gonna do it in this weather? Do you wanna grab the other fishing rod, Harp? Yeah, just give me a second. There we go. Oh, snap! I saw a killer recipe for baked carp. We'll need to catch three carp, though. You up for the challenge? Yeah. Well, first things first, we need the right bait for carp. Check out this bait information board. Oh, we need bait. Whenever you are ready, grab a carp, bait, and let's head back to the creek. We're going to catch some carp, Harp. 
Please don't have. Please don't make rhymes in my name. Let me grab the bait. Which one was the bait that we needed? It's a common carp. So we need sweet corn. Hold on. There we go. I got sweet corn. All right. Oh, God. This is going to take some time. Where's Nora? Do you reckon Nora's dead? Chat, you reckon that Nora is dead? I hope there's carp biting today. Okay. Need to attach some. My bed! Why, can't, why couldn't we have just gone to a shopping center and just do it from there? I, am I the streamer that's had the worst RNG on this specific part of the game? Oh, thank you! Finally! All right, Hump, looks like you got free cup. Do you want to head back and throw these in the oven for dinner? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do now. Now, 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 now. While I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the marinade? How do you do it? Just take a bowl and throw in ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, Italian seasoning, paprika, and yogurt. Oh, all right. Can I prepare the marinade by go getting some motherfucking uh, yogurt? Extra virgin olive oil. <laughs> salt, black pepper, and an Italian seasoning. Oh, there we go. Oh, gosh. Ew. Do you mind throwing the fish in the marinade in the casserole while I chop these veggies? I don't want to. Two cups. Marinade. And uh, I don't want to put some vegetables. Now, could you add the veggies? I, re I really need to go for 30 minutes at 400. 400, 30 minutes, for 30 minutes at, um, how long again? Wait, do we just do it automatically? Those carp are gonna... That was not open before. This is why I said I'm gonna shut all the doors. Because if one of them's open, th that's su that is such a telegraphed... Mm, no. While we wait for it to cook, how about we play some board games? I saw some in the room next to the living room. So you mean the basement? Which one? Just grab whatever catches your eye. Can't wait to see what you pick. I saw some in the room next to the living room. Oh, a Luigi board, really? Fine, we'll play Luigi. Oh, I don't want to play with a Luigi board. Oh snap! Is that a, is that an Luigi board? A Ouija board, not an Ouija, but wait, wait, hang on. Molly once told me how she contacted her dead grandma through one of these boards. I can't stand her spiritual bullshit. Hey, remember how the dude was acting weird about the basement? What if we tried this down the... I love how our option is, that's a... That's a great idea! I'm with that! Watch out for spiders down here. Why are you saying that? As if I literally wasn't here a second ago. Where's Nora? Like, seriously, where's Nora in all this? Oh boy. You know what will make this even spookier? He's gonna say the lights out. Let's turn off all these lights and see if this thing really. Oh no. All of the lights. Ba, 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 ba. Anyways, do you know how this works, Harper? Oh yeah, I do. All right then, you go first. <clears throat> oh wow, the text is even weird as well. Are there any spirits you want to talk to us? Uh, you're not even doing it right. F. Where? Where you go? Oh. Uh, huh? Oh, what? You said yes. Is that yes? No way. Are you moving it? That wasn't me. You're moving it. Yeah, you're, you're literally moving it. How's the afterlife treating you, buddy? Hey, be respectful. He's going to say shit. All right. V. L. Uh, where are you going with this? Did you live in this house? That's a good question. What? I don't think the spirits can spell. Come on, buddy. Give us a sign. Let us know you're here. There's going to be like a big loud noise behind him. I knew it. Holy crap. Wait, Mike, wait for me. I'm not usually one to believe in ghosts or spirits. The mic! We didn't even say goodbye. You're supposed to say bye to end it. There's some freaky shit going on down there, Harp. That was weird. The weird part is that you ditched me. Yeah, exactly. You ditched me. What the hell, Harp? I figured you'd move your ass too. Would it be nice if you checked? Have you ever heard of fight or flight? You pussy. Sydney, I'm sorry, okay? <sighs> Whatever. I think our show's about to come on. You want to watch TV while we eat? Yeah, sure. All right, let's go get our scran. We had to catch that show on TV while we ate. Why aren't you doing it? This delicacy is very popular in Romania, where mayonnaise flows down the rivers like a yeah. mayonnaise water park. <laughs> so first, we are going to prepare... Yeah, it sounds like Belize. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is good for the bones. <laughs> After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. 
Oh my god, what's scratching this? Ah, that was some damn fine food. Twice as good since we caught the fish ourselves. Yeah, I was alright. You don't have to rain in my parade, huh? There was no mo speed zip, but I thought it turned out well. Hey, anyways, I need to check my emails real quick. Left my laptop upstairs. I thought we were taking a break from work. It's not work. I'm just waiting on shipment details for my new DS. New DS? I'll be right back. Alright, I will guess I'll clean up here. Only for experienced cooks. It requires a lot of patience. Alright, no more TV. No more Belize. This is not gonna end well. That we're still wearing our shoes indoors? Damn. All right, let's go wash. We're doing it with telekinesis again. Yeah! There better be no one at the window. Ah! All right, we're good. Oh, Michael J. Carter. One message. I think there's someone under my bed right now. Can you come upstairs? Stop pulling my leg! I think it's just Mike. You pussy. I think it's just Mike just being like, oh, I just wanted to get you here so that we can like have a walk slow. How do you walk slow? This is such a this is such a setup. He's he's gonna scare us. All right, where you at? Where you at? I told you! Gotcha! You're lucky I didn't break your nose. My good looks are half my charm, Harp. Don't mess them up. But I'm, I'll break your fucking face, bro. I totally got you. That was fun, wasn't it? Whatever. Come on, it was just a joke. You want to go for the next round? What do you mean next round? What do you mean the next round? How about a game of hide and seek? I'll get, I'll, you know, I'll get you back from this. Whatever you say, Sydney Harper. All right, you're on. I'll count to 10. All right, shit. Let's find a... Let's find a good hiding space. I decided to hide in the you dumbass! Oh, oh, oh! We're gonna hide in that room. We're gonna hide in that room, aren't we? We're gonna hide in that room. We're hiding in that room. We're gonna hide in that bookie ass room. We didn't even say goodbye to the Ouija board. Oh, had to get Ouija board. What do you mean had to get Ouija board? I decided to hide in a nook under the stairs. What? What? Aha, got you. That wasn't even a challenge. I figured it would be for good at this as I never found you in the city. Foregone conclusion. I bet it was a foregone conclusion. Maybe you need to look harder. Ooh. All right, my turn to hide now. You better close your eyes and start counting. Space to close eyes. All right. One, two. We're doing one Mississippi, really? One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three, four, five, six, seven, ten. My sis, I, Pi. Ready or not, here I come. Or well, I'm coming. I'm coming. I have an idea of where it could be. All right. Can we, we can't open this. He's going to be in here, isn't he? Wait. Oh, there you are. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> All right, I got you. Hang on, Harp. I think I heard something upstairs. Fool me once, shame on you. You fool me, you can't get fooled again. No kidding, Sydney. I really heard something sliding up there. You didn't hear it? No. No, I did not. I swear on my life I heard something. I see this attic access door in here. What the fuck? What? What? Bro! All right, these lights are going on. <laughs> oh, hi! Aw! Wait. If the cat's here... Oh, we can pet the cats! If the cat's here... Oh, shit! Oh! 
Oh no. Sydney, are you okay? What was up there? Looks like you aren't the only pussy in the house. Oi! <laughs> what do you mean by that? It was just a cat. Oh, that's a relief. I was worried there for a minute. I think she was hungry. Oh yeah? Maybe we can give her one of the cup after I come find you again. All right. What? Why did I just teleport down here? <laughs> okay, I decided to hide in the tool shed in the backyard. I see a little silhouette of a man. This feels... Oh, shit. Oh, ah, there you are. Damn, Hop, it took me a while to figure out you left the house. Anything worth doing is worth doing well. My turn. Close those pretty eyes now. I'm getting tired, man. Look, I'll hide in the house. We're headed back in anyway. You find me and we'll go to bed. No, seriously, where's Nora? I, 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 oh, we should have shut the door. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. I gave him no time. I'm gonna find his goofy ass. Oh, that's open. I don't remember that being open. Where are we gonna find him? Where are we gonna find him? He's not in the basement, is he? Hmm. What the fuck? Ah! Hi! What's going on? What happened? Hey! What are you doing here? I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you. Well, hey there. Wait, it's... Is it actually Rick? Like, Rick, why are you back? We don't... We never saw a picture of him. What? How do we know it's Rick? Rick, why are you back? And what are you doing with that hammer? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? You should have told us. Miss, this is my house. I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something. I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before. Yeah, yeah. You haven't fixed many forces yourself, young man. Do you think so? But I'd imagine you don't know what tools you need. Isn't this late for you? No trouble for me at all, miss. Right around the block. Told you to get a sink fixed for you real soon. Do you think maybe you can fix it tomorrow? You're asking me to leave, miss? And no, Rick, she's being polite. We rented this place and would like to have it to ourselves. I, we don't really want to have to call law enforcement. Mike, please let me handle this. I ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. Oh no, think they're gonna arrest the homeowner for fixing the faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, it's your problem, not mine. You know what? If you folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. Yeah, sure you were fixing the faucet with a hammer. With a hammer. I don't buy that one bit. After locking the door, we debated on what to do. We agreed there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. Is that the end of the game? We attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. It's not the end of the game, is it? It's just gonna be like later in the night, right? Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. By this time, I was feeling really tired. I decided to get some rest. Right, what do you, what do you want? What do you want? Hi. Harp, are you still awake? It's hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. Do you mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. Sure. The storm starts to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. I hope Nora's okay. She'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry. I'm here to keep you safe. What? Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over people they care about, right? Um. What, what, what are you, uh, what, what are you saying? What a day, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our ghetto was gonna go, Sydney. It has been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. Um, he does own, the, he, he does own the place. You know exactly what I meant, Sydney. You shouldn't just barge in the place whenever you want. We rented the damn house. I mean, the guy is probably harmless, but I'm frustrated. Um, me too. It'll help if we both get some sleep. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Whoa, 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 Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? No. Can I say no? Pop, you know. This is like, oh, that's the kind of, no. I hope we can like, hang on, I'm getting ready to, there we go. All right, here we go. I've missed it. I've missed this. Us just talking. It's been too long. Stop. Before you continue speaking, what are your motives here? What What are your motives here? 
Whose master do you serve? He's not saying anything. You know, you don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. No, whoa, 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 whoa. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Would you be doing this if Nora was here? Yeah, 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 exactly. Would you? Oh, he's thinking. You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. I do remember it really well, actually. Oh, yeah? Pray, do tell. I remember it being pretty awkward. It didn't start out awkward, though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happen. That's what I, that's what I said. That's what I said. I knew it. I knew it. They sure did. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. Oh, oh, SOS. Pre I guess I've been meaning to talk to you about that. You just let me worry about the details, Sydney. Mike, I don't think this is a good time. What the fuck was that? Wait, let me, let me listen. All right, no. Guys. I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. You idiot! It's snowing and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. Lily! There's a sign by the side of the road. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. You idiot! <laughs> I hate to ask, but... Can you two come get me? Yes, yes, yes. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. All right, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. What a timing, huh? But I guess we can't leave Nora stranded. No, we can't. We better get ready. No, Sydney. You stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in both of us freezing our asses, mate. Oh. Are you sure? Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you sure you want to leave me alone? Rick is going to come back. Wait, hold on. It's either Rick's going to come back... Or, oh, it could be someone else. No! Let's both go! Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. You're in pajamas and I'm still dressed. You just settle in and I'll go help Nora. That's really nice, Mike. I always like doing nice things for you, Sydney. Please, yeah, at least be careful. Shit. This is not good. We'll finish talking about this later, okay? Get some good rest and stay warm. I mean, if you really feel like we have to. I'm going to, I'm going to bed. I'm going to bed. I'm going to bed. I couldn't have gone to without locking the front door. Woo, that's a good shot. Yo, I hope there's not another way to get in here. Oh my, oh my God. He left it open. Hey, why don't you get some rest while I'm gone? Are you sure it's safe to drive in this weather? Don't worry, I've driven in worse. Besides, Nora's probably freaking out more than you right now. Yeah, you're probably right. Look, maybe you take, make sure you take care of yourself and lock all the doors. You sound like my dad. Can you blame me? Before I go, how about a hug? Just in case you're asleep when I get back. Uh, I guess we're going to hug through the door. <laughs> we teleported through the door. <laughs> Sweet dreams. Get some sleep, Sydney. All right, drive safe, Mike. I don't know. I feel like I feel like it's a setup. Did we lock the door? I think the door's now locked. I am going to bed. I was keen on getting some sleep until Mike and Nora arrived there. Hell yeah, I'm going to get some sleep. There's going to be some noise in the attic. Why are we in this room? I told myself things would get better if I could just get some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up and I needed it more by the minute. With her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. 12.39 a.m. Oh. Ah! Is that the door? Is that the door? Oh, shit. Someone was at the front door. It's either... Go it's going to be Rick. But maybe it's someone from, from the pizza. I saw you there, my friend. Please open the door. I'm freezing to death. Maybe it's the guy. Hold on a second. Maybe it's that guy. Come Holy fuck it. Holy fuck, it's him. I can see it. I can see him. Do you have any idea what time it is? Look, friend, I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm a bad spot here. Counting on a ride from some friends, but they're running behind and won't be here for a... Whoa! Yeah, 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 yeah. It's the backpack. Yeah. It's the backpack, dude. Yeah, you can sit on the porch while you wait. Yeah, no, get, get the fuck out of here. You're not coming inside. Thanks. But I was hoping you'd let me wait inside until my friends get here to get me. Literally, didn't he say exactly the same excuse? I know, I know it's you! You're not coming in. Fuck off. 
Are you fucking kidding me? You're gonna let me freeze to death out here? I didn't make you go hiking in the snowstorm, you fucking idiot. I should have known you'd be as big of a bitch here as you were back at the pizza joint. I knew it! I told you. I told you it was... It's him. It's him. Literally, I went and hazarded a look real quick. What? You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but it looks like you're still unkind. Get her all call the cops. Wait, but he's gonna be like, there are no cops here. Ain't no cops around here. Speaking of, I don't see your fellas truck out here either. I'm dial I'm dialing 911 now. Fine. Suit yourself. Is it locked? Yeah. Listen. He's gonna try and get it. He's gonna try and get in. But let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Come as a bitch, my friend. The man at the door seemed irrelevant compared to how tired I was. No! I couldn't keep my eyes open. I had to get some sleep. No! God damn it! He, we didn't go to sleep. We didn't go to sleep. We ain't sleeping. We're tweaking. We're tweaking so hard. I heard a scream. I can't even get out. I can't get out. What the fuck? Oh, no, no, not that. Not the obligatory, you must hide. It's fierce to fathom. I had no choice but to call for help. Wait, what? Shit. Let's text Rick now. Now. Rick. Rick, I'm sorry to bother again, but can you come back over? There's someone. We met driving down there. He was banging on the door, started threatening me. I'm pretty scared. I think I am moving outside the house. Could you please come look since you live so close? Oh, no. Oh, this is bad. We texted Rick. Oh, I think that's Rick. Shall I do it? That's Rick. I recognize the, I recognize that jacket. That's Rick. Open the door, miss. It's me. Shit, okay. Okay. Okay, it's Rick. What the hell's going on here? Oh my God, thank God. Did you see anyone outside? I might have seen something. Could have been anyone or no one at all. All right. What do you mean you're not saying anything? Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. Bro! I wouldn't worry about him anymore. What do you mean I wouldn't worry about him anymore? What the fuck did you... Oh, whoa. I saw that hammer. Wait, did you hear the screaming? I think he fucking killed him. By the way, where's your friend? The guy who was with you earlier. Mike, he went to pick up our other friend. He should, I'm gonna say he should be back soon. So you're all alone here right now, huh? Oh no! <laughs> Damn it! Why is everyone so shady? Yeah, but my friends will be back soon. Why is he looking, bro? Why is he looking? No, 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 no. Where's he going? Where's he going? Where's he going? Wait, what? Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. We're leaving. Wait, what? Rick, come back. I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I told you, 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 literally it's the visit. I I literally, what did I say? What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Oh my God! But can we get the fuck out of here? Still didn't feel safe opening the door. Oh my God! We can't go upstairs. We can't go upstairs. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew. I knew. I knew it. I knew it. Fucking, we can't go upstairs. Everything okay, miss? I I yeah. Awful late for texting, isn't it? Who are you talking to? It's my friends. The I'm gonna lie. It's my friends. The almost here. Is that so? Yeah. Thanks for coming by, though. I'll be fine now. You can head back if you want. You sure about that? Yeah, I just overreacted. Maybe I should stick around and make sure everything's really okay. You need to leave right now. What did you just say? Yeah, let's confront him. The is my fucking hat. Wait, what? Oh man, you messed it up with backup. Anyway. This is my fucking house. You need to leave right now. I don't think so. If anyone's leaving this house, it's you. It will be one of us. Wait, what? The fuck? He left it! No! I instant. What 
you mean I instantly died? I instantly died! What? Wait, where do I go? Where do I go? Damn it! <gasps> and it's gonna be like, then the attic, and then the. Only that. For God's sake, I'll have to get it later. I mean, there's nothing to really... Fuck am I supposed to do now? I guess I wait for them to realize... Where is the cat? Open the door, huh? I heard a loud open the door. He's still down there. Oh, 911 was called. Yay. That waiting did work. They've called 911. <laughs> Fucking. I'm just, I'm just gonna press, I'm just gonna crouch the whole way. <laughs> Thank you. God. What took you? I told them everything that happened after Mike had left. Rick called the cops. The storm had quietened down by the time they arrived. 
And of course, the man was nowhere to be seen. On our drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in that cabin when it wasn't being used and planned on robbing us during our stay. But the cops seemed to think there was more intent behind this man's actions aside from just robbing us. Rick asked me what the man looked like and after that, he didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on. But in the end, he gave us a full refund. Hey, full refund! And that is it. Survive through the fifth episode. Achievement. Well, that was good. That was good. For us. I think it wasn't as good as Iron Bark Lookout. I really liked it. And these were nice anthology stories as well. You can see the trope of him not actually being Rick come from a mile away. I did say it was like the visit. I'm actually excited to see what, what Ray does next. Because Fist of Fathom was a nice series. That's a nice series of games. That was Woodbury Gang Getaway. Out of all of them, I'd say this one's on the middle tier because if we look at all of the episodes, I think I I, I vibed with Iron Bark and Carson House a bit, a bit more than Woodbury Getaway. But this was a... I feel like... Um, the all the games are consistently decent there wasn't really anything bad i can say about the game as in i did like the amount of red herrings that there were in the game like at first you were like oh yeah the game went long enough about rick being there that you were like huh this could actually be rick but the thing is that they never asked if he actually was rick and they also never asked if the faucet like why like they never they didn't press it further it did feel like norwood hitchhike didn't it like i guess a, i guess a, a remake of norwood hitchhike i do feel like this game was like pretty good as in it did its job well and it was to tell a story that was somewhat grounded in reality about someone's uh experience at an uh, like at an event that changed their life but yeah first of fathom was pretty decent and i'm excited to see what the developer does next but for those of you guys who are watching on the second channel thank you guys so much for watching if you want to watch the first to fathom series in general and maybe you'll make a season two i don't know but if you want to watch the series series so far um implying is gonna make more there'll be a playlist in the description down below but for those of you guys who are watching on the second channel thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in another video